Hello, it's Terrence Thomas of Monster Golf Swing. In this video, I'm going to show you or explain to you how to use your legs in the golf swing. I'm trying to reach 20,000 people, so go ahead and help me out and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just a quick uh, background about me. I'm a Czech certified golf performance specialist and a strength and conditioning specialist. I've been doing it for 24 years. I've got tons of clients in different sports, not only golf, but other professional athletes, football, baseball, uh, elite endurance running, and a few other sports. Um, I am the author of The Monster Golf Swing, and if you want to know more information about that, go to, go to monstergolfswing.com and watch the free video on there. So on to how to use your legs in the golf swing. So first and foremost, the hips are first. If you do not have control over your hips, your legs are going to be uh, rendered useless. So your hips are what control your legs and your ability to use your legs during the golf swing. So it's important that you have control over your hips. And this goes for any sport. Hip intelligence is the hallmark of any athlete. You have to have a intelligent control over your hips. Now, in order for this to happen, three very important muscles must work as a unit. Hamstrings, hip flexors, and the butt or gluteus maximus. The rump, backside, or whatever moniker you want to give the backside. Now when you bend over to address the ball, what's going to allow you to do that is your hip flexors. You're going into basically hip flexion. So if your hip flexors are weak, you'll end up doing it from your spine, which is always a bad idea in the golf swing. Now also, if your hamstrings are tight, you will also bend from the waist and you will put yourself at risk of injuring your spine. And while you're bent over, what's going to protect your spine is your ability to stabilize your spine and your hips using your butt. So these three muscles have to work together. Very, very important. And then finally, you want to make sure you have adequate knee and ankle mobility. You need about 15 degrees or so rotation in the ankle and about 20 to 30 degree rotation in the knee, depending on the anatomy book you look at. So it's important. Those are your three keys to using your legs more during the golf swing. Give it a shot. If you want specific exercises and drills to address these issues, go ahead and um, subscribe to our YouTube channel. But more importantly, go to monstergolfswing.com and it will outline exactly how to deal with this and how to show you how to use your legs more in the golf swing. And if you follow the program, you can add up to 70 yards to your drive if you so desire. If you haven't already, go ahead and like our fan page on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash Monster Golf Swing. And I look forward to helping you play your best golf ever. If you have any questions, you know where to find me, uh, Facebook fan page or YouTube. Take care, guys, and I will talk to you soon. Take care.